Live from WBFF in Baltimore, this is Fox 45 Morning News. Well, staying in shape doesn't always require you to make time for the gym. It's getting easier to work out from wherever you are. Here with workouts for the busy professional as Fit to Go Home Workout Library, we have Donnie Singer, owner of Fit to Go Personal Training, and we have Krista Michael, registered nurse and personal trainer. Thank you guys for both for being here. Yeah. It's one of those mornings, kind of wake up and you're like, oh, it's hard to get moving. <laughs> That's the point, right? <laughs> this is the last day you want to go to the gym, yes. right? When it's gross, it's groggy, it's raining outside. And that's the whole idea is most people think that they need a whole gym, all this fancy, complicated mm -hmm. equipment to get started, and that delays them. They'll put it off. What we're going to show you today is how you really need nothing but your own home. You can have just your own body weight, but you can use a couple pieces of equipment to just make a more versatile and effective workout. And today we're launching the fit to go home workout library, okay. which we're going to give them the link to at the end. Awesome. And so we're going to demonstrate a couple of the exercises today that you can do at home. Okay. I'm going to step out of the way and let you and Krista take over. So Krista is our director. She's a registered nurse and personal trainer, but today she's serving as our fitness model. <laughs> All right, so with the way this works, these are the fit to go bands right here. Now, if you're not a fit to go client, you can't get these, but I'll give you a link where you can get these on Amazon as well, um, a similar version. The way these work is you anchor them into your door. So these basically recreate like a cable machine they would have at a gym. Now, these are normally anchored in a door. I'm just going to hold them now for a demonstration. She's going to do a chest press. So this is the exact same motion you would be doing as a bench press at the gym. Mm -hmm. So she's working her chest, she's working her triceps, the back of her arms, and that way she's getting that push, one of those main motions. Now, when she flips around, so there's four main movement patterns. That's number one. The second one is a row. So this is where, if you're at the gym, kind of pulling towards you. You see this a lot in the cable machine. And now she's going to be pulling back towards her. Exactly. So there, it's the exact opposite motion of the push. Now she's balancing that out. This is one of the best exercises you can do for your posture, working that upper back, pulling your shoulder blades down and back to make her stand up nice and tall. Next, she's going to go into her lower body, and Chris is going to show us the two main lower body movement patterns. First, she's going to do a squat, and with the bands here, she's adding in extra resistance. So that's how versatile the bands are. You can really hit every muscle group. So she's going to go ahead and squat back. And that way she's hitting her glutes, she's hitting her quad, she's hitting her hamstrings, she's hitting everything in her lower body. And this, the squat is one of the most functional, most healthy exercises you can do. And with the bands, then you can add that in with a little resistance. You can use a dumbbell as well. Today we're just showing the bands. The last one is a hip hinge. This is the one people are less familiar with. The term people might have heard is called a deadlift. Sure. Um, but the hip hinge is basically where there's a squat, Chris is moving at her both her knees and her hips. With a hip hinge, it's dominated at the hip. So it's getting more of the posterior change, so the hamstring and the glutes. So this is called a good morning, what she's doing right now. But she's like wanting to make sure to keep her back really straight. Exactly, yeah. That's where most people will kind of slip up, is they'll move through their spine. They'll kind of arch. Mm -hmm. And what Chris is doing, she's keeping her abs and her glutes locked in so that her spine is moving like a board. So there's no movement from her hip to her shoulders. She's just moving at her hip. That's why it's called a hip hinge. Okay, and we got, we're just getting a sample of this, so where can we go to get the workout guide? You're free. Yeah, it's absolutely free. So if you go to fit2gopt.com slash workouts, then you can sign up there, and it's going to be live today, and you'll be able to get all of the full workout library. We're going to have a new one every single week. All right, really cool. And a great time for this. I know that's probably not coincidental right here. People are making those resolutions, so coming up. Thank you guys so much for being yeah, here. Absolutely. Thanks Thank for having you. us. Welcome to the Fit to Go Home Workout Library. So this is your spot where we're going to teach you how to make fitness practical with a busy schedule. So we have three steps to get you started. Number one is become a fit to go insider. So you're gonna join the email list below. Just drop your name and email. Then I'm gonna shoot you an email every Friday. You're gonna get it from me, Donnie, um, with that week's workout. It's gonna have a new home workout each week. Really quick, focused, and effective to get you results. Step number two is you're gonna join the tribe. The Busy Baltimore Fitness Tribe, you'll all see a link below. Now that's where you're gonna get the daily videos and you're gonna get access to the community with the questions and answers. So you're gonna have questions throughout your fitness journey probably will already be asked and answered by somebody else. So you can just go in there and you can snoop if you're a little shy, you can just watch everybody else. Or if you wanna participate in the conversation, go for it. Step number three, last part is to get your gear. Now, let's be clear. You can get a fantastic home workout in and get great results with nothing but your own body weight. That said, there are a couple tools that if you grab will definitely get you a little bit better results. So, in honor of the launch of the fit to go Home Workout Library, I've partnered with our friends at Gym Source. Now this Saturday, January 4th, first Saturday of 2020, we're both, myself and Krista, are gonna be stationed at Gym Source in Timonia. Now, Gym Source is our partner who provides all the home fitness equipment for Fit2Go and for all of our home clients. 
and I'm going to be there live 12 to 4 p.m. where you can just show up in person and I'll be doing complimentary consultations to get you started with your own home fitness routine. So it's totally free. You can just show up. We'll talk about your fitness goals. I'll help you figure out what it is that you actually need in your own home to hit your fitness goal so that you're not wasting money on fancy equipment you're never going to use. You're not paying for a gym membership or a bunch of weights you're never touching either. So that's it. That's all you got to do to get started. Do those three steps below.